When I started to train for this year, I had three big goals in mind. The first one was to run a sub 9 minute 3000 meter, which I just got uh, done. And now, already the same week, it's time for my second big goal, which is to win a 30 kilometer trail race that will take place here on the beautiful island of Jelö in a fjord in Norway. The island which has become our home since we moved here last autumn. In some ways having the goal to win something is not the best kind of a goal because it's not that measurable. Of course it depends a lot on your own performance and your preparation but it will also depend on how your competition will be doing. But I still wanted to have this as a goal because for me in my training it was really motivating to try to go for a win on this really cool trail race on my new home trails here. The race is called Tretopsleppet which means the free summit race and that's because during the race you will summit all the three highest peaks on this uh, island. And as I said, the race is 30 kilometers long and it's a mixture of some really technical trails and some faster sections. This year the race will be held with individual starting times and I will be trying to pace myself to a time that would have led to a podium place last year and then hopefully I can speed up uh, during the last part of the race and compete for the victory. But running this long of a running race is something completely new for me so I'm a bit nervous on how my body will be handling keeping a high pace for uh, this long. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to getting to experience my new home island in a new way and of course I will give it my very best. Today is race day and I'm feeling excited and ready. I'm out on a short morning jog just to get my legs moving a bit. Just two kilometers or something like that before breakfast and Legs feel fine, so hopefully it will be a good day today. <laughs> okay. So here the course goes along the coastline at the beach here, and then it continues up in the hills over there. So I'm really looking forward to push hard when I get to that point. I'm having a very simple breakfast with some <laughs> some coffee. It smells good. <laughs> and some porridge and the raisins. This will be my kit I will be bringing on the race. I will be wearing a running vest and uh, for energy I will bring uh, three uh, energy gels and one bottle of uh, sports drink and that should hopefully be enough of carbohydrates for this effort and then i bring a note where i have written down different split times i want to hit uh, during the race and then i bring also my action camera so i can uh, share the experience with you and try to film a bit uh, along the way so this is my kit feels good on and it will actually be the first time i'm uh, running with a running vest as well so I'm borrowing it from Eli, she's more experienced in this trade running events than me. <laughs> but yeah, it feels good. So Elin is kind enough to drive me into the start. <laughs> it's not that far, but I want to save my legs. <laughs> So good to have started. Okay, let's find my zone. First hill climb of the day. I'm down at the sea level again and I feel like I'm good now. I'm good to start to the race. I'll just try to keep this pace. 
for the next 10-15 kilometers and hopefully I have another gear then. I got in the start of the race that I wanted to the first summit and was a bit ahead of schedule there. But I think I got a bit too comfortable after seeing that so I lost a lot of time on the next flat section. So if I wanted a shot at winning this race I needed to speed up a lot towards the second summit. Climbing mode again. managed to speed up a bit and was now just in front of my schedule again, but I was starting to feel tired so I was very unsure for how long I was going to be able to keep this pace. Starting to feel it, but I'm in the last half. I worked hard and managed to get even more in front of my schedule and at this point I was really tired but also so ready to give it my all when I was approaching the final climb of the day. Ah, okay, let's go for it. <laughs> Last summit of the day. Oh, I just have to kick down it. Thanks. So I was told at the finish that I came in in second place. Uh, I think it was 30 or 40 seconds uh, down to the winner. So I was close to achieving my goal of winning, but you can't control how other people uh, run. And I was impressed by the winner today. So congrats, and I will be back uh, next year to to try to do an even better race, but I'm super happy with my run. I think I paced myself great and it was fun to try a long trail race. So, as always, train smart, have fun, and I will see you in the next video.